Arduino landing gear and, and uh, the protective dome assembly. Alright, let's put the camera on. Ah, there we go. Okay. Now I show how, how to create the protective dome. There's on, on every packet they have uh, four these kind of uh, arches and uh, also four landing gears. On some packets there's actually eight landing gears. There's a one extra packet because just before I was shipping them out I noticed that I had some problem on, on the landing gear holes. The one hole was the upper one hole was actually in wrong position, so I had to make a new ones. That's why there is that so-called spare landing gear package. Use them. The other one you you can you can use the other one, but you have to you have to make this kind of a double hole. What I have on this one, this is one of those wrong ones. I'm just using them because it doesn't matter. Just make another one, three millimeter hole, and, and it will be okay if you happen to break the original ones, but I doubt if you can break it, I can just congratulate you because I haven't been able to break them, never. Alright, uh, these are from yeah, these are from packet number 5 having 12 small polycarbonate screws and, and uh, nuts, also 12 pieces uh, also, we need to have the dome center. On dome center part, back you have uh, the lower one ring and the upper one ring. And also you have screws and four nuts. Um, and and this one, the upper one, uh, sorry, the lower one ring. The centerpiece of the dome is, is, is especially designed for MTEC, this GPS devices. And I mean by that, you can see the hole in here, and there's a battery behind the MTEC. You just place the battery like that, and it goes nicely in. Alright, but anyway, I will show that a bit later. So, how to do? How to assemble the whole whole frame? Oh, we can actually start from the center part. If you have the GPS, now it's the good time to go and mount it. So let's do it. First, I put that is wrong ways. So ah, this way better. You should have the antenna on center of the of the piece. If you if you put it wrong ways like I was doing first, you cannot get it properly aligned. So you have to change it on the other side like that. And let's so that way. And how I'm mounting it? Well the easiest way is just use chip type, put it on here in, put it out from the other end and now there we go ah, like that and no need to use force on this one we don't want to break it anyways it's just keeping it steady like that there we go all right now we can continue next the mounting screws the locking screws um, I always put them on these one holes. One and two. Like that. Good. And then we just put nut. Up on number one. 
if the nut is a little bit tight you can use screwdriver like this and remember again because we are using uh, composite materials you don't have to screw them so tight because they are by their nature they are sticky so they won't fly away yeah. there we go like that you have a screw and you have the locking nut okay now next thing I'm often building it just like this placing the mount um, placing the arts like that it should be looking like this okay it's a little bit difficult to make it happen when, when the arches are not mounted on a quad so let's put them on a quad first I will because today I'm, I am not at the office I will use my own quad and I'm building it on that one okay First of all, this one, if you can see it, there's a small area that some material has been taken away. This one goes against the arm. So let's put the screw from outside. One, two, three. Like that. Okay. Put it against the arm. They can uh, landing gear fin and just put that one in. There we go. Up. Now, and on this point, don't put the screws too tight because you you maybe have to move this little bit this way so just put just put them enough that they can hold it properly around and against the arm just because you still have to able to move it like this way okay now I just put the other one other four quickly And if you have problems to uh, put the nut one way, you can always turn it upside down because they are not totally symmetrical. One more. Now it starts to stand by its own legs. Again, from outside, you can put these one screws from the landing gear side or the dome side. It's, it's it's up to the user itself, which way you want to have it. One knot. Two knots. Nuts, nuts, nuts. <laughs> okay, now, next thing. Now it looks like that. Like you can see, they are. This is really far. This is closed and closed, and but at least they can they can move like that. Yeah, like that, and this one also. 
Now, take your centerpiece, place it on under one, under one like that, like that. And remember, on first time when you open this one and take the package, it is a little bit difficult to play, put it in, so just press it in. No need to use excessive force, but just a little bit. They, they will get a little bit more loosened after you've been using it, but on the first time they might be feeling some tight. Anyway, put the first one in the hole, and the hole, hole is, uh, the arch has to go in this one, long one, or holes what are in the edge, there's four of them. So, let's put that one. Okay, it seems that we have to move this, this one leg a little bit. Let's put that one. Move that one leg. Around middle up. Okay. And then that one. Now they are all close enough so we can basically just put them on. That one a bit more. Like that. And now, just the top ring. And quick, quick. There we go. Now we are on this. It looks like this. And next thing is just to secure the upper one ring with the two leftover nuts. looks like that. And now you can look that, okay, is it on a center? If, if it's not on a center or some of the arms is a little bit pushing the other one, now it's the good time to go and make it on, on totally, totally center. Just moving, move the arms and, and after you are satisfied that it's on center, then just take a screwdriver. Uh, there and tighten up the screws a little bit. Again, no need to use excessive force. It's enough to hold. This is enough. You don't have to use pliers. You have a two leather pliers in your personal tool pack. Tool pack. Mm. Just like that. There we go. Ah. Now, now they are strong and not moving anymore. Hmm. Okay. And this one you don't have to push them too tight. I was putting this one a little bit so it bending like that. That's not good. Don't 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 push it so far. It, the main idea is just to hold hold them together, firmly together. And now if you have the key, GPS cable, you can go and, and, and plug it in. Like that. Oh. There. There we go. Okay, that's it for this time. Next time I will show how to make the last one piece, model mount. Okay, bye bye.